gave me two Patrick Mahomes cards in one pack back to back. That's pretty weird. I wonder if I can call them and get a and like get a refund. <laughs> Be like, hey, this isn't right. I have a recording that shows that something happened. <laughs> Um, excuse- On Twitter, just be like, explain yourself. What is this? Panini, explain. So today, I'm opening two things. It's really just five packs, but it's two things. One is this pack of Absolute Football 2018 Panini, which I got for free from ordering this. This is episode two, by the way. I haven't said anything. I haven't intro it at all. So, uh, this is episode two. I have a box of 2019 Topps Luminance cards and one pack of Absolute Football 2018, which I got for free from ordering stuff. Because apparently when you are in an attic, they give you constant uh, you know, free stuff so you can just keep growing your addiction and you know, they just know their audience. So I'm gonna be opening both of these Take a look real quick at this one. This is just some kind of um, basic pack, but this is the real like cool one because it, these cards look beautiful. Like when you open them up, you could be like, oh my God, Edward, those are a work of art. They look fantastic. I can't believe that they are like this pretty for cards. And they actually are just aesthetically like valuable to look at. Uh, it's gonna have like 10 packs per card. Uh, I mean, 10 cards per pack and four packs in total. Very few cards, however, three autographs and one memorabilia per average. And that means you could get more, and maybe you could get less, but if I get less, I'm throwing a tantrum. I, I don't care. You guys are gonna watch me throw a tantrum. I just do not care. We're gonna start off with this pack here, which I'm going to use scissors on the entire time, because this time I was prepared. Well, let's look at what we got in here. First of all, that looks great. Oh my god. <laughs> um, actually impressively good how, how this looks. It looks like the old NBA 90s cards. Um, we got Julio Jones. Tom Brady. Uh, uh, Tyrod Taylor. Is this Trey Quinn? It's a rookie card. Yeah, it's a Trey Quinn. Name's card to see, but it's right there. A Marlon Mack card. God, look at that. It sparkles. Wow. <laughs> These actually look awesome. Oh my god. They do really look like old NBA basketball cards. A Russell Wilson card. Cool. Leonard Fournette. We are not a pro Leonard Fournette show. Like, really important that we do not show any joy when we get that card. And then Devonta Freeman. Falcons card. These are quite nice, actually. The Trey Quinn rookie card seems to be our uncommon here. Anything special about it? Any numbers? Anything of the sort? Hmm. Not particularly. Time to get into what's really, really cool, what we really came here for, and that's this Topps Luminance box, which I'm excited to get into because I've already bought one of these before I thought about doing a show about any of this stuff, and it's they just look so good. We're gonna open these up one by one. These are gonna be four packs per box. One's already popped out. It's excited to be open. That's why I just dropped it out. Um, we have four packs, four packs per box. This is an expensive box for four packs, to be quite honest with you. And I would never be happy if someone knew how much money I'm spending on this. But I already spent the money, so no one can say anything about to it, about it to me. And it's time to open one of these. Oh, I mean, look at it. It's just this full like photo that just looks really pretty. And first of all, that's Patrick Mahomes, who I'm really happy to have because I love Patrick Mahomes. Is that a second pack? That is two Patrick Mahomes cards in a row. I'm already very upset with this pack. <laughs> I have no idea how the factory made this mistake. All right, Lamar Jackson next. Thank Thankfully, it's not a third Patrick Mahomes card. Okay. Zach Ertz. God, it looks so good. Oh, we have a gold ink here, a gold ink Greedy Williams. A, uh, this is a limited edition, you can see the numbers on in there. They are quite, they're not a, they're not a limited set. What's 155, one, is that 153 out of 275? Not an unlimited set card. So pretty cool, the gold, let's see what we got here. What's this, what's it, what is it? Oh, cool, you got a signature, a Travion Williams rookie signature. Trayvon Williams, I think, went an undrafted free agent for, not an undrafted, he might have been a late round pick for the Bengals, I think, 73 out of 75. But this is still like the college version of him, so you still have the college team on there. 
It's quite nice looking. I'm quite happy with any signature I get because I just find the signatures to be more exciting, more fun to look at, anything else. We have another gold ink? What is this one? Is that a gold ink dynamic? That is a Philip Rivers gold ink card. Is it gold ink? No, that's just a dynamic card. Never mind. <laughs> Drew Locke rookie card. Cool. Uh, not a fan of Locke at all. I think he sucks. Uh, Dylan Mitchell of the Minnesota Vikings. Never heard of this guy. And Darrell Henderson of the Rams, the future starting running back for that team, as is inevitable thanks to Todd Gurley's uh, in missing knees. We're down one pack. One exciting pack, too, because we already have one signature. There's a lot to look forward to. Uh, Corey Davis starts us off with the second pack. It looks just such a good card. I mean, look at the action shot, even. It's just... It's much better than the running on air that was, that was in the common in the other packs. Aaron Jones, very sweet. Look at him, just like trucking something. No, he's not trucking. Yeah, he is. He's trucking a, an Arizona Cardinals defender. Well deserved, I'm sure. Zay Jones catching in traffic. This is not a common occurrence. They're really hyping up Zay Jones. Matt Breida. Breida? Breida. Looking pretty. What's this? A Carry On Johnson Gold Ink. Is that 215 out of 275? It just looks good. Look at it, just, it's just a good looking card. I wish this thing could stay in focus, but it is a good looking card. And what is this? We have a Irv Smith Jr. signature. Actually, wow, that actually looks very nice. He wrote in the number. <laughs> this is actually a really clear signature. This is a very clear signature. This person, um, I don't think he knows how to write in script, so he wrote a Perfectly print clear signature um, with number with his number on it. I like anything that looks sort of out of place because it just makes it more memorable. We got one of these light speed cards that are in these sets for David Johnson. These are like the same things that they had in the last set where they're like the player's fast, so he has a card. They wanted Amir Abdullah. They didn't actually want David Johnson. We all saw the video. I think it was Hard Knocks. We all saw what it was. Uh, Chauncey, I have no idea how to say his whole name. Chauncey Gardner Johnson. Darwin Thompson from Chiefs. And who? Oh, Devin White. Cool. First round pick. Pretty nice rookie cards. I mean, the, the art's just really pretty on these. You can't be upset with the way these look. I don't know. I'm, I'm obsessed with them. They have a nice aesthetic. I'm obsessed with the word aesthetic, aesthetic, and I enjoy things that look good. Even if it's just a bunch of football cards I just spent a lot of money on. Uh, Jared Goff. Starting next back with Jared Goff. Phillip Rivers, quarterback heavy. Well, quarterback heavy, Kirk Cousins. Baker, this is a quarterback only pack, isn't it? Baker Mayfield. Who's this? Tyre Brady? I don't even, I've never heard of this name before. Like, I consider myself just slightly knowledgeable about football. 21 of two, out of 275, but I've never heard of this player. Who's this? Uh, is that another TJ? Wait, is that another signature? It's definitely a signature, right? Yeah, this is a signature. What? A TJ Hawkinson signature. It doesn't look like his name at all. It doesn't really seem to have any indicator of like rarity so is this just a forever signature you can make they can reprint these forever some kind of legend card for benny barry sanders yeah i don't really care none of these classics matter to me i don't view history as valuable feel free to throw it away jj arcago white side rookie card gardner Mishu Minshew rookie card and hunter renfro rookie i remember when hunter renfro was like the big a big deal on draft twitter where everyone was like oh he's going to be a notable slot receiver you should probably know him he should be drafted highly he's really likable uh no one in the nfl seemed to really think the same which makes sense because he has no he has very little production behind him and there's not really much to be excited about regarding him because he's not very athletic either nick chubb matthew stafford leonard Fournette. Montez Sweat. Is that, a, is that blue ink? Oh, shit. It is. That's a rare. It's a blue ink rare. 18 out of 99. And then we have another Gardner Minshew. This one, gold ink. 47 out of 49. This one's even rarer. And then what? What do we got here? We have a patch. We have the Sean Watson patch. 
that's nice. Deshaun Watson is a is a cool player to get for sure. Damn, that texture is really good. This 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 camera is ridiculous. That texture is beautiful. Jeez. Julio Jones flash card. What does this have? Anything? Quadre Collison. Alex Barnes, UDFA. I like, I like seeing any rookie that has no chance of ever making playtime at all. It, it's just more interesting. Now I have a card that will never have, and no one will remember. And Paris Campbell. We have four packs, all done. And we end up with a total of four pieces of work for four pieces of like memorable material irv smith jr irv smith jr shaven Chave, uh Travion williams name i'm not gonna remember how to say tj hawkinson who i don't understand if this is a rare signature or fully like reproducible one i really hope it's like somewhat rare but i don't see anything that shows that it's rare at all and then a Deshaun Watson patch, which is also not exactly rare. It doesn't have any numbers on it, nothing about it. Four nice cards, all looking pretty. In a very sweet pack, very sweet set. It just looks nice. It makes me feel good to have. I mean, look at it, look at it. Look at it. Gosh. Remember to like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.